All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy, the DoorDash Revolution. Smash the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, like and share this video, leave comments down below. I'm just looking at right now, Germantown Commissary is on the hot, hot spot. We need to talk about my experience that just happened um, probably an hour ago. I had an order going to Germantown Commissary. I was heading to Mulan Bistro and I get a hit 4.7 miles, 14.75 diamond plus. So I had to go half a mile, no, about a half a mile, make a U-turn, come back to Germantown Commissary. And uh, what happened is that when I got the order, I showed up, I checked in, I checked in with the restaurant staff and they turned around, dude laughed and he said, look man, you, you third driver. The third driver came and um, for this order here. This order has been rescheduled. It's okay. It's beginning to be an ep epidemic every time I come over, it's a problem. You know, out of the order them being canceled or it's been, been rescheduled or a driver done ran off with the orders. We need to get down to the bottom of this and find out what's going on at this establishment here today. That's what we need to find out. So we typically did our research and I went ahead and I called driver support and everything, premium driver support. You know, once you become a top dash, that's what they tell you. You know, you're going to get the best service, the best PI, VIP service, customer service from them. You're going to get the best business etiquette, quality customer service that they give to the delivery drivers off of drive support. Due to your higher ratings and all of that, and plus being a top dash. So I explained my situation and everything. Well, hold on for a second. I explained my situation and everything, right? told him that uh, I was told by the customer as well I asked the merchant that uh, this order post been scheduled not at 2.30 but 5.30 to 6 o'clock and um, the, um, John he was very helpful and everything and he went ahead he checked with both uh, sources he also checked the email notification and everything and seen the communication that I had with the customer you know, so while he was doing that, I was on the phone with another driver, talking to another driver about the situation as well. We trying to analyze what happened. I said, maybe um, they might have ordered it. It wasn't that they ordered through the website. So out of what happened was they ordered through DoorDash, but they probably, the customer called the restaurant operator and told them that, uh, I need to reschedule that order. And the restaurant itself probably didn't reach out the door to ask to let them know that the schedule been, you know, reschedule the order. And the order has been rescheduled. Or the customer didn't reach out the door to ask and let them know that, okay, I want to reschedule this order. I just went through the restaurant and done it restaurant with a hit and did it and that's that's how somebody dropped the ball so the representative got back with me and explained the whole situation and everything that it did go through our customer support but something happened to where it didn't show it being rescheduled so what happened is that um, the customer still wanted the order they was like going to reschedule that order this order will have to be canceled, you know, because we're not able to meet that obligation. If you wanted it at the time, you're going to have to recounsel the order, you know, or you're going to have to let the delivery driver pick it up right now. So they went ahead and they, DoorDash went ahead and canceled the order. I got half paid for it, you know, so, oh man, I got a hit. 
Hope I didn't miss you. Oh, I missed the order. I missed the order. I missed the order. That happens every time. Mm, 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 mm. How did the 30 seconds disappear that fast? Never mind, but um, that's like this what kind of day I have. It looks like I get I get something going on with this phone, something going on here. I, you know, I took time, you know, I don't know how it went off the screen like it did. I'm going to keep my eyes open this time. Man, I hate that I missed that order. Boop. And, it, and it was Firebird, too. Man, 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 man. That was a good order. Mm, mm, mm. Lost it. Can't crawl with spilt milk, so uh, I'm gonna get ready to end this live, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, they came to the sol solution, a uh, resolution for the problem, everything. I got ha I got paid half pay. But have any of you had this experience of where the customer rescales the order? You know, think about it. It could have been one of those three scenarios. So if you have, share it in the uh, comment section. Let us know, and all of that. And I'm gonna go ahead and push this video out. Thank you for what you guys do, interact with me and everything. You know, on my live stream morning shows and everything, we're getting a good, good, good audience. You know, good collaboration with the audience. Good collaboration with merchants and customers and delivery drivers doing our ride-alongs. I just thank all of you for participating mm -hmm, in this community effort in order to make it better food delivery experience for the merchant for the driver for the customers and for driver support i salute you for riding with us in this movement and trying to make it better for the whole marketplace platform peace take care and we will see you in the next video